Welcome to Branching Out. I'm Katie Algram, Director of Innovative Professional Learning with the Kane County Regional Office of Education. When you think of the term snowball, what comes to mind? Perhaps snowball fights? Winter? Being cold? But how about a fun new discussion technique to implement in your classroom? Snowball discussion, sometimes called a pyramid discussion, is a great way to promote engagement and have the students become the teachers. To implement the snowball discussion into your classroom, you need to start off by introducing the topic or concept to your students and provide them with information to review independently. The information you provide can vary based on the topic, needs, and age of your students. Some popular media include photos, articles, books, websites, videos, and podcasts. Once the information has been shared to your students, Give them 10 to 15 minutes to review the information and possibly even write down a few key facts that they learned while reviewing the content. After they've had this independent think time, have students get into partnerships. At this time, the pair of students share their aha moments and main ideas with each other. This process is then repeated and the pair snowballs into a larger group where the partnership joins another group now you have four students sharing their most important concepts with each other. You repeat and grow your group as the partnership of four becomes eight, continuing to snowball into bigger groups until you've reached a group size that is comfortable for you and your students. Follow up the small group discussions by a whole class discussion where the main ideas from each group are shared for all to hear. Now it's your turn to branch out and implement the discussion routine snowball into your next lesson. Don't forget to share your experience with us by tagging us on social. And as always, thanks for watching Branching Out.